just when I thought I was out, they pull me back in. That is what the Yankees have done to me in this series. Just when I was ready to really, really abandon them, they come alive and win two out of three against Boston. This is a depleted team with all the COVID issues, with just the awful first half of the season they had, people really ready to just give up on this team. And they win two out of three against the best team in the American League East and one of the best teams in the American League and in baseball, period. Uh, the Yankees offense did a great job tonight. I love that seven, eight, and nine all got hits. <laughs> that That is insane, especially when it, you look at, you know, you have guys who you've never heard of before just coming in and delivering. Um, I'm really starting to uh, love Greg Allen. <laughs> he's, he's batting 600 right now. He gets another hit tonight. It was uh, an RBI sack fly. Uh, but the Yankees just do a great job here. You look at the, the whole game here. You have Glaber go back-to-back -back games with a home run. Uh, hits a home run there in the second. Uh, then they get a run uh, in the third off a Stanton ground uh, into a fielder's choice. You have the Allen sack fly in the fifth. And then in the seventh, you had Odor with a two-run home run to make it 5 nothing, And then back-to-back bases-loaded walks, which I can't remember the last time I've seen that. That could not be a frequent occurrence. But Torres and Gittens both get intentionally walked uh, by Hernandez. Hernandez was just horrendous. Uh, in the, it didn't even get an out. Uh, gave up four runs and really put the Yankees over the line here in this game to... Get him to, to, for the win. Um, this is... I keep saying I don't want to do big picture with the Yankees here because I still, I still don't know how to look at this team going forward. I don't know if this is going to be the turnaround. But it is amazing to me that with all the COVID issues they had and with so many guys out and them bringing up new guys in here and guys getting injured throughout the series, the Yankees still win two out of three. That's crazy to me that they were able to do this here. And again, you have Odor, you have Lamar, you have Allen, you have Torres, guys who've either just come up or guys who've not been successful this year being the guys that helped lead this team to these victories. And that was insane to me uh, in this game. The Yankees did go into another, into another double play. We have to mention that. Am Ambergy, um does it here. But, and also got to give a shout out to Jameson Tyon, who has, in his last three starts, really, I don't know if I have his last three starts in front of me here. I'm going to try to pull it out. But has really stepped it up in these last three starts. In this start, five and a third, four hits, no runs, two walks, and three strikeouts. He has really been on – all right, his last three starts, a combined 18 and a third innings, 11 hits, three runs, five walks, 16 strikeouts. His season ERA is now 4.6. In, in his last three games, he has really delivered. He has really turned it on for this team. And I'm really liking what I'm seeing here. And it makes me feel a little bit, feel a little bit better about this rotation. It makes me feel just a little bit more like, okay, maybe maybe the, the bad stuff was at the beginning of the season. Maybe they've really turned it around here. Uh, at least at least that's my hope here. Because um, uh, we're going we're gonna to need the, the starting pitching to really step it up uh, between Tyone and Cortez. We're going to need them to all deliver here so that we don't have to rely on the bullpen just in case you know Chapman comes in there. Um, but, yeah, so, so, so Tyon was the MVP of this game for being so lights out uh, against Boston. And then, again, the, the, the guys that we just pull up here, the guys that haven't delivered all year, leading us in this uh, series has been really impressive there. So I can't believe we pulled this off. I can't believe we won two out of three. I was especially done with them after the first game, but they win two out of three. I'm feeling good here. I think Yankee fans can start to breathe a little easier. We can start to be encouraged that maybe, just maybe, the bad stuff is, you know, is, is gone. We, we can look ahead here. Maybe the Yankees are going to turn it around, which of course means we're probably going to get swept by the Phillies. <laughs> maybe we won't. Maybe we won't. It'd be nice if we didn't, but... Every time I start to feel good about this team, they let me down. Hopefully that is not the case this time. Great job by the Yankees in this game. Great job by the offense and Tyon. And the bullpen, as always, as the Yankees win two out of three against Boston. That's it for now, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to this channel and you like what you see, make sure you subscribe down below for more content just like this every single day. I'll be back on Tuesday, breaking down the first game between the Yankees and the Phillies. Take care and God bless.